Previously on Gears. We used to protect Cog settlements. Now we're about to raid one. <laughs> Raiding is what outsiders do. Lieutenant, you've been busy. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need this fabricator. I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking my people. What happened? The short version? The cog is on his way. You promised me you could steal that fabricator without provoking Jin. This has nothing to do with a the fabricator. Then what did you do? Jin accused us of taking her people. Yeah, whatever that means. Get the fabricator to the power station and install the inverter. You realize Jin's coming back, right? We need to leave now. Mom! Hey, listen. You need to hide, and then you need to run. Look, you know as well as I do that he can help. Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken? Dad, you should look at this. Shit. Uh, guys? Thought you said you weren't running from the cop. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. We need to get through that fort to the abandoned Osmond mine on the other side. The Cog dumped a few thousand locust bodies in there after the war. If your swarms related to the corrupts, we'll find out there. Then, I guess we're all alone out here. We definitely found where they're coming from. And where those snatchers are going. My dad's alive and he's down there. Planet Sarah, things were not always peaceful. For year after bloody year, human settlers fought each other in the Pendulum Wars, a brutal struggle for control over a new energy source called Emulsion. After eight decades of conflict, a coalition of ordered governments emerged triumphant. However, victory by the Khan did not bring peace, because a new threat was coming. Just six short weeks after the end of the Pendulum Wars, Locust! the vicious Locust Horde erupted from underground caverns, slaughtering everyone in its path. Locust troops have breached the courtyard. We're on it! What became known as Emergence Day was the start of a new conflict, one for which the human race was in no way prepared. Imagine that. Serving as a gear in the Cog Army, Sergeant Marcus Phoenix became a fixture on the front lines of the Locust War and a legend to other gears. Well, that's one thing we agree on. For 10 years, Phoenix fought in battle after battle. His stature only grew when he was imprisoned for disobeying orders after a futile attempt to save his father, Professor Adam Phoenix. I've come to get you out of here. I've got to save my research. 
Four years later, a desperate cog put Marcus back on the front lines. Welcome back to the army, soldier. Humankind was losing ground every day. They're flanking! Only one stronghold remained. The capital city of Jacinto. Then, on a mission into the heart of Locust territory, Phoenix made a shocking discovery. The Locust Horde was actually fighting a two-front war. Exposure to the emulsion energy source had transformed ranks of the Horde into a new threat, the Lambent. These monstrosities had been attacking the Locust for years, and so it became clear. Emergence Day was not an invasion. It was the Locust's attempt to escape an even more deadly foe. They're desperate. All this time, we never realized that. Realizing humanity would never be able to defeat both the Locust and the Lampman by conventional means. I'm sorry. Phoenix proposed a radical solution. We need to sink Jacinto before the Locusts leave, not after. By sacrificing the last remaining human city, oceans would flood the underground caverns of Sarah, wiping out the Locust civilization. Two years later, human, Locust, and Lambent survivors alike battled for resources on the surface. <laughs> so much more diplomacy! Marcus was sent on a new mission after a mysterious message revealed his father was alive and in desperate need of help. I need your help! Fighting across the shattered ruins of Sarah, Marcus eventually reunited with Adam Phoenix. Marcus. Lambency, Adam Phoenix revealed, was caused by the emulsion energy source. It's not a fuel, Marcus. It's a living organism. And so Adam Phoenix had developed the ultimate weapon, a countermeasure that would eradicate emulsion and the Lambent threat, and in the process, end the Locust once and for all. There's too many! Hold them off! Just hold them off! In a brutal final confrontation, Marcus Phoenix fended off the vicious Locust Queen as his father readied humanity's last chance at survival. The plan succeeded, father and son triumphant, simultaneously wiping out all emulsion, Lambent, and Locust everywhere on Sarah. But this time, there was a terrible price to pay. Adam Phoenix had used emulsion on his own cells to study their devastating effects. And soon, father and son were torn apart for a second and final time. Alone in mourning, as the world celebrated the end of the Locust War, Marcus Phoenix saw little hope for the future, and nowhere left to go. But after some time, Marcus started a new life with fellow soldier Anya Stroud. Eventually, they had a son, James Dominic Phoenix, better known to his friends and squad mates as J.D. As the decades passed, the coalition of ordered governments reformed itself. Human civilization began to rebuild, and the Locust War became a distant memory. Now, 25 years later, J.D. Phoenix has become a warrior in his own right and has uncovered a new threat, a mysterious race called the Swarm. J.D.? J.D. doesn't know what these creatures want or where they came from, but he knows he won't be able to face them alone. Dad! Once again, war has come to Sarah. Once again, a phoenix will rise to fight it. Presenting Operation 5 Hollow Storm. Our biggest update yet that is full of everything you want. Five maps. Seven characters. And tons of new rewards. Go deep under Mount Kadar in an epic fight in the Locust Stronghold, Nexus. Survive above the clouds in the towering arena of Regency. Battle for your life amongst destroyed ruins and echoes from the past in River. And two more classic maps, Gridlock and Clock Tower. For Horde and Escape players, we're giving you the freedom to play the way you want. Pick your class. Pick your character. 
and destroy the swarm. Operation 5 Hollow Storm has arrived. Lieutenant Delmont Walker, reporting for duty. Yo, Baird, how long is it gonna stay dark in here? Wait, dark? Where are you? Where you told me to go. Oh dear, miscommunication. Dave, uncloak. All right, can you at least see Dave? Yeah, I see Dave. All right, working on getting that module powered up. Could you just hurry? Ah, lights are glitched. Iris, open the doors. Certainly, Damon. What the hell, man? Hey, we had to get light in that box somehow, didn't we? Hang on, we'll set you down. Oh, tell me again why you got me out of my perfectly good bed for this? All right, I want to upgrade our security bots for combat against the swarm. Everything you do, the sensors on your armor will record. Man, you think your boss gonna be able to compile my moves? Uh, yeah, I do, actually. <laughs> nice landing, Bear. Thanks. Okay, we need to calibrate those sensors to just follow day. Good, now keep up with them. Man, I could be having brunch right now. Your waffles will be there when we're done, kid. <laughs> I see Dave. Wonderful! I, I love it. Anyway, uh, now hit the keypad. Excellent! Iris, bring in the next module. Incoming, Damon. All right. Step one for combat-ready DBs is making them use and understand cover, like you would. To the next piece of cover, please. All right, now swap to the adjacent piece of cover. Nope, no good. Try it again. Perfect, we got it. Now hug that wall and move left. Pretend you're taking fire. Pew, pew, pew. Good, data's clean. Now, let's make it more interesting. Our DB's gotta learn that enemies can still hit him in cover from an angle. Using the cover, break Dave's line of sight so they can learn how to move like a real gear. All right, down. Dave, bring up your targeting laser. Oh, you can't find me. Kind of fun. 
Okay, let's wrap up this module with a cover mantle. Take cover in your Dave. Now, mantle up and over. Good! So, how you feeling, kid? You know, limber and... Iris, activate the sprinting trench. Certainly, Damon. Running at full speed while keeping your head down does not come naturally to a bot, so let's show him how it's done. Race Dave to the other end, kid. Iris, count down, please. Three, two, one, go. Good. Now race Dave back to the start. Iris. Three, two, one, go. <laughs> Too slow, Dave. All right, good job. Data's clean. Just think, every time it sprints, it'll have your distinctive gait. Lucky them. What's next? Iris, ready to shooting module. Finally. Shooting module has been placed. Okay, grab a Lancer, the COG's most trusted and versatile firearm. Man, how could you not trust something with a chainsaw bayonet? All right, kid. Incoming Guardians. Take down their shields and destroy them. DB Guardian online. Okay, now aim down your sights. DBs love to hip fire. We need to change that. No hot fire is done. using blind fire to destroy them while keeping yourself protected and covered. <laughs> now that's good data. Put that in your thing. For some goddamn reason, DBs have trouble nailing a perfect reload. Show them how it's done. solid data there. Not bad, not bad, but let's up the challenge. Can you take down a moving target? Shut! Easy peasy. Good. Let's move on to explosives training, shall we? Grab some frag grenades from the rack. You sure you want DBs tossing frags around? Uh, have you met the swarm? Alright, now equip it. Iris, bring in some volunteers for Lieutenant Walker to blow up. Yes, dear. Er, Damon. Yes, Damon. Uh, you didn't hear that. Uh, uh, Baird, how does blowing up DBs help train them? They're old custodial units. I was gonna strip them for parts anyway. Okay, just like when shooting, keep your head down and blind toss the grenade. Unit operational. I'm here to help. One down. Boom! Put my eyes closed. Great. Now open your eyes and target the rest. Just wind up, aim, and release. That's one. Terrific. This module's almost complete. You ready for a live fire exercise? <laughs> Does Marcus like tomatoes? An emphatic yes. Grab some fresh ammo and frags, then get back into cover. These Shepard DBs are using shock rounds. Take them out. No problem. Aim for the head, they'll go down quicker. Quick is good. Start. And try mixing things up between firepower and explosives. They'll use the same thing. Citizen safety concerns deactivated. Attacking. Reloading weapon. Retain all lawful targets. Ah. Assaulting. All right, all right, I'll admit it. This is way better than Brunch. Excellent work. 
Data looks good. Ready to move on? Sure. Why not? Great. Now for a quick exercise in field medicine. Iris, bring in the patient. He is joining us now. What's wrong with him? Looks fine to me. Dave? What a pleasant day we're having. Help him up, Del. You know, for science. I got you. I got you. Your assistance is most appreciated. Now, word of warning. This next one's gonna sting a bit. What are you talking about? Dave? DB, help him up. Damon. This is not part of the training protocol. Are you instead having fun with Lieutenant Walker? Iris! Ignore her, kid. She's uh, on the fritz or something. Citizen, it appears you need aid. Oh, well, you're a real dick, Baird. Hey, kid, do me a favor and scrap that custodial unit for me. Just use your Lancer's chainsaw. Really? Damn, man, that's cold. as well. Brunch is over anyway. That's the spirit. Iris, initiate the next training module. Preparing now, Damon. Grab a Nasher shotgun off the rack. Ooh. Already know I'm gonna like this. Come to Papa. Clear out those shepherds. Need as much close quarters data as I can get. Watch me work, baby. Citizen safety concerns deactivated. That Nash is made for close range combat, kid, so feel free to get in their faces. Citizen, yes! Good to see you, Citizen. Boom! Citizen, prepare for. Hey, you like that? I know I do. Good to see you, Citizen. Good work. Oh, and Iris, we're gonna need cleanup in Module 7. Anyway, ready for the hand-to-hand -hand module? Come on, when you're born ready, you ain't got to get ready. Uh, yeah. Just follow Dave. module. First up, use your combat knife to take out the deactivated DB. That seems a little unfair, but okay. <laughs> While it's down, let's grab some finishing move data. <laughs> impressive. Excessive, but impressive. All right, coming up next, some in-cover maneuvers. Let's do it. Okay, take cover behind the next shepherd. And now give it a yank. And insert knife. Almost feel sorry for me. Hey, with learning comes sacrifice. Line it up, mantle over, knock it back. And insert knife. And I'm sensing it. Okay, now let's do the counter. Get into cover. He's coming for you. Counter him. Who fear you? Excellent. Now put him down. Man, this is mechanical slaughter, man. Oh, really? Well, what do you say we grab some data from a fair fight? Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. You don't have enough robots to make this a fair fight. Oh, yeah? We'll see. Gear up and we'll get started. Ah! 
Iris, initiate Combat Simulation 12. Damon, Combat Simulation 12 will provide a gear as skilled as Lieutenant Walker with minimal challenge. Iris, I knew I loved you. Okay. Simulation 13. Higher challenge, better results. Worst case, Dell's in the hospital for like a week or two. Wait, ho hospital what now? Oh, you'll see. Just get to Dave and we'll get started. Say hi to your teammates, kid. Hi, teammates. Greetings, Lieutenant. Iris, bring in their opponents. The incoming enemy units won't be holding back, so get me data I can work with. Let's go, fellas! Team down all the way! You need it. I'm gonna go eat. I will begin analyzing the data shortly. Iris, what would I do without you? I shudder to think, Damon. Previously on Gears. We used to protect Cog settlements. Now we're about to raid one. <laughs> raid? 
Hating is what outsiders do. Lieutenant, you've been busy. Look, our village hasn't had power in weeks. We need this fabricator. I don't care about the goddamn fabricator. You're taking my people. What happened? The short version? The cop is on his way. You promised me you could steal that fabricator without provoking Jin. This has nothing to do with a the fabricator. Then what did you do? Jin accused us of taking her people. Yeah, whatever that means. Get the fabricator to the power station and install the inverter. You realize Jin's coming back, right? We need to leave now. Mom! Hey, listen. You need to hide, and then you need to run. <laughs> Look, you know as well as I do that he can help. Our village was attacked. And my mother was taken. Taken? Dad, you should look at this. Shit. Uh, guys? Thought you said you weren't running from the car. Yeah, that wasn't completely accurate. We need to get through that fort to the abandoned Osborne mine on the other side. The car dumped a few thousand locust bodies in there after the war. If your swarm's related to the corrupts, we'll find out there. I guess we're all alone out here. We definitely found where they're coming from. And where those snatchers are going. My dad's alive and he's down there.
not ready for this. She can barely keep her eyes open. Don't worry about her. She'll be ready. Okay, we're almost at Bear's coordinates. Welcome to Azura. time you slept last night got a good eight or nine minutes in nightmares does it get better it gets tolerable Burial site in silence. Hey, get back! Oh shit! The hell? Uh, I'm trying to search a place that's falling apart. Quickly. Come on, we can use the ledge. plan to launch a satellite from here? It seems a little half-baked. Well, half 
Fake plans are kind of Baird's specialty. How Baird even figured out they had a hammer cell here? My father? Before he died, he let Baird in on a few cog secrets. And this island, uh, it has plenty of them. Cut through. Okay, let's go. Hey, back. We're coming down. Huh, guess who? Dave, send a pulse and let's see what we're dealing with. Ah, there they are. How do you want to do this? I'll take care of this one. Alright, let's take him out! Get in the cover! site is active. Shit. Okay, Condor's in the air. Let me know if you need reinforcements. We get it handled for now. Delta out. Come on, we gotta find one of those silos. Assuming the swarm haven't ripped them all apart. Hey, I think we can get down this way. Let's just find a silo. For the record, you don't seem okay. I'll live. There's too many active hives. Everywhere we go, another burial site's hatched. All the more reason to get the hammer of dawn alive. Let's hope Jin sees it that way. Hey, 
in a silo. There, we found one of the silos, but it's wrecked. Well, there's two more. One of them's still operational. Hope you're right. We ended the war once on this island. When we get this hammer satellite up, we can do it again. That's the idea, old pal. Control out. So, Sprake's not an option. What rocket base is even left? Let's find out. You guys go right, Marcus and I will go left. We'll find those silos. Sounds good. Stay in contact. You sure about this? Two silos, two paths. You got a better idea? Del! Hatch! Jump down! This looks like some kind of an exhaust system. But is it from a silo? Only one way to find out. This sluice gate's our way out. Dave, can you get this open? Man, you know what? If they want to turn this place into a hive, let them. It's an isolated island hundreds of miles from shore. Uh-huh. Let's just make sure that happens after we leave. See? Dave gets it. Okay, let's find that side. Going down. <sighs> so much for a silo. So this will do. Yeah, under here. Oh, man, we got company. <laughs> I see you. We can provide support from up here if things get hairy. Just tell us who to target. Get the drone first. Got my target.
Copy that. Watch it, swarm. Control, that carrier's down. Thanks for the help. Thieves, one of you secure the area. The other's with us. Let's go. Acknowledge. Nope, locked. We'll have to find another way to open it. I know he's opening a door. He's doing a lot more than that. Well, either way, the door's open. Thanks, Dave. So, that data Dave just downloaded? There's a big hole at the highest security clearance. How does this relate to our mission? It doesn't, but now I need to know. I'm guessing whatever's missing was pulled from the network. Well, who'd have the authority to do that? Back then, uh, only the facility commander. Find his office and poke around. Okay. Moko. Hey, Pulse. Standing in the area. Detecting all inferior cloud technology. <laughs> oh, come on now. That's just me. Too hot. 
Commander's office is through here. Now, this door is locked. Dave, try that vent. See where it goes. So, Baird once lost data, huh? What does it even look like? Well, I mean, if it got pulled from the network, it probably got stored on some kind of external drive. <laughs> nice one, Dave. Dave, pull! All right, commander's office. Let's look around. Safe. Good place for secret data. Gotcha. Hey, Control. Good news. We found the data drive. Appreciate it, Delta. Hey, you know what we'd appreciate? Some backup. What? Where are you? The silo. We found it. And they're all over us. Oh, shit, we're on our way. This way. Nope, dead end. You're in. Start the launch sequence. Pressurized. First stage. Opening silo doors. Error. Error. Uh, Error. Delta, we have an issue. The silo hatch. It's not opening. Oh, of course. I knew that seemed too easy. Baird, options. Bug out. Blast doors aren't going to protect you from an exploding rocket. All right, then we call it. Let's go. Hydraulic external power to on. No. We get that hatch open. What? Kid, listen to your old man. You gotta get out of there. Damn it, we came here to do this, so let's get it done. Ignition test commence. Dave, with me. Ignition, engine one. God damn it, James. Got to learn to stop following you. Yeah, good luck with that. Well, let's get that hatch open. 
So what's our plan? I don't know. Gotta be a manual override there at the top. Fire the way up. Take the issue. Engine two. That's not good. No, it, it's not. Got it, Bob. Platform's down. Let's go. Sam, we're ready for extraction. How about I see Jen first? I'll calm the storm before you brief her. I'm sorry, is this Sergeant Phoenix being diplomatic? You can call it what you want, but we're at war, even if it doesn't feel like it yet. 
We all have to be on the same page. Yeah, well, I mean, if you think it'll help, then sure. Wish you'd have been this willing to listen back at that silo. Hey, it worked out, didn't it? Listen, James, word of advice. Stop trying to prove yourself. Just do the job. Dad, I took a necessary risk. Necessary means you have no other option. That wasn't necessary, and you know it. What was that about? What do you think? Same thing it's always about. Hey. You know it's just because he cares, right? Yeah, well, you know a hell of a lot more about him caring than I would. Okay, um... Yeah, um, we're just gonna go inside. Come on, Dave. That was a shitty thing to say. Yeah. Yeah, I'm... I'm sorry. The thing is... You two are more alike than either of you want to admit. The data is in front of you, Damon. What? What? That's it? I thought the new satellite would automatically link to the old ones. He cannot find them. Without regular scheduling from telecommand, tracking accuracy degrades. <sighs> Thanks a lot, Iris. Your vocal sentiment does not match your words' literal meaning. Thus, you are not actually thanking Please stop me. talking. So, I still can't find the other Hammer of Dawn satellites. On the plus side, I accidentally invented an AI that understands sarcasm. Here, that data drive you wanted. Maybe it'll help. Find lost satellites? I doubt it. But I'll take a look. Wait, hang on. Did we do all that for nothing? Oh, it'll fire. But with only one working satellite up, it'll be tough to control the beam. Ah, uh, what's wrong with Dave? They've had a few problems. What kind of problems? Uh, that kind. Oh, I know I'm gonna regret this. <sighs> Everyone, meet the new Jack. When the hell did you have time to build this? When did I have time to build this? This is what I do. I sit here making stuff you guys don't appreciate and inevitably break. Okay, so what's different about him? Whole new range of behaviors. Improved scanning, augmented combat and support modules. He's literally one of a kind. Uh-huh. And... And he's... all yours. <clears throat> now, if you'll excuse me, I have a bazillion 40-year-old satellites to find. Damon, there are only 15 missing satellites. Thank you, Iris. More sarcasm to add to your growing library. Before we begin, Damon, the combat module you brilliantly designed is now ready. My use of brilliantly was intended to be sarcastic. Did I succeed? <sighs> Follow me. You'll want to equip this new module ASAP. It'll make Jack combat ready. Oh, I'm gonna take this. It'll give Jack what I've been calling Flash. It blinds, stuns the enemy. Installed and equipped. So, how do we use it? I'll show you. Over here. Okay. Grab a weapon and get into cover. Then we'll start the test. Take that. Iris, activate 
Alpha 331? Certainly do. So, say you've got a target that seems awfully comfortable behind cover. Jack's flash ability fixes that. Aim at the DB and activate. See what happens. Jack Flash! Test sequence complete. Oh, that could be useful. Now, let's try it again with multiple targets. Iris, activate Alpha 332. Incoming, Damon. Jack's got a reroute power for two flashes. Once he's recharged, hit him again. Flash! Reroute initiated. Nice work. Feel free to run it again if you want. Test sequence complete. No offense, JD, but uh, Jack's my new best friend. I'm very happy for you, for both of you. But now I need you to return your weapons to the weapons locker and get out of here. Are you trying to get rid of us? Oh, you noticed. Anyway, you can boost Jack's abilities if you find the right components. Before you go see Jin, stop by the armory. They might have one you can borrow. Oh, we will definitely be doing that. Good. Now I can get back to work. What Damon means to say is that he has more important things to do. Thank you, Iris. Bluntness is one of Iris's more commendable traits. I wonder where she gets that from. Jack Bulls. <laughs> Whoa, that smells less than great. So there. I know you were kind of mad when Jin shoved you in here. How do you like it? Oh, I, I'm enjoying it. The workshop's quiet, peaceful. Damon is not being truthful. Shortly before you arrived, he was highly critical of the First Minister, referring to her several <laughs> times as a... Let's not get into specifics, Iris. Also, why did you tell him that? I detected genuine personal concern for you in Corporal Diaz's intonation. Oh, I thus judged it appropriate to inform her how you truly feel. Who? Inappropriate sarcasm. Incompetent nurturing instincts. So close to getting the Iris, fully operational. Are you sure you're not secretly my mother? Later, Baron. Come on, guys. No worries. Do your thing. Come on. Hey, Foz. How's life in Jin's rear echelon treating you? Brilliant. But then we can't all be off on some secret mission. Oh, yeah? How'd you hear about that? This is an army, not a monastery. Yeah, okay. Well, look, we'll just leave you to the very important work of punching machines. And sparring. Hang on a second, shit stick. Shit stick? Del, theories? I don't know. Or maybe a stick made out of shit? Or, or a stick used to stir up shit. All right, fuck off. How about we make this interesting? You and me, spar, right now. And how exactly is beating you interesting? Yes or no? <laughs> you want in on this? Pretty sure what's actually being measured here is gonna leave me at a distinct disadvantage. Then again, maybe not. Hilarious. Are you in or not? Oh, I'm in. Come on, man, let's just grab the Jack component and get out of here. No, this will be fun. Oh, son of a... How's that fun working out for you? Try it again, Foz. Come on. Here's the thing, Foz. The bottle's far with you, but not beat you. It's against their programming, but explain. Shit. Your false confidence. Quite a bit, actually. Want some advice, Phoenix? No, I'm good. Jen does love her golden voice, but never for very long. See, that was fun. Fuck off. All right, man. Now that Fa's fun time's over, can we go find that component?
It's not even noon yet. <laughs> ah, there's the component we're borrowing. Or stealing. I prefer borrowing. Indefinitely. Can't wait to test them out in the field. Try to contain your excitement. We still have to go to Jen's office. Yeah, Dad's probably had enough alone time with her by now. Could get used to the field of view in those things. Hey, Jack, pose. <sighs> okay, come on, enough's enough. You gotta see someone about these headaches. I will. I promise. After we talk to Jen. Let me be perfectly clear. When it comes to this weapon, I don't share your optimism. It's the first time anyone's accused me of optimism. Yes, well, I'll remind you your wife refused the idea of bringing the hammer back online. I would have thought you'd respect Anya's wishes. I'm gonna pretend you didn't say that. For both our sakes. Anya would have wanted you, you to... You don't get to talk about her. If that's what you think, I won't argue. You and that goddamn fertility program. A program that gave you your son. And mine. I honor Anya. I loved Anya. Oh. I don't care if you believe me. When my program was in its infancy, she came to me. She volunteered. Both times she volunteered. Seeing First Minister Stroud undergo treatment. Do you know how many children are alive today thanks to her? She should be buried here, you know, with the Allfathers. The people need her inspiration. Your inspiration was my wife. First Minister. Lieutenant Phoenix and his squad. Send them in. Ah, Lieutenant. I'm told you had a successful mission. First Minister, I can explain. By all means, explain when Damon Baird superseded me. Explain how launching a Hammer of Dawn satellite doesn't require my explicit approval. Same page, huh? Lieutenant, the Hammer of Dawn has taken more COG lives than most of the armies we've opposed. Your father knows this as well as anyone. It's not the weapons I don't trust, First Minister. It's the people who use them. The Hammer of Dawn will not be brought back online. Ah, that'll be a report on the evacuation of Settlement 2. Settlement 2 is being evacuated? Why? There's been activity in the nearby burial site. Chief Carmine, report. Oh, we're under attack! We need immediate help! Please, slow down. Send reinforcements! No! Mobilize the 4th Division. We'll take command of the reinforcement effort. Do it! Go! Jane, we're getting close. Where do you want me and Kate? Main gate! Keep anything else from getting inside. You realize I'm the ranking officer here, right? And we'll reinforce Carmine at the town hub. I can't believe we're back here. We did our duty. You need to get over it. Get over it? 
Guys, not the time. Cole, let's see what we're dealing with. Down. You patch us through to Carmine? Uh, no can do, kid. His radio's out. You okay? I can see him at the central hub, so he's up and fighting, but the swarm's all over him. Hurry if you can. Run our way. Come on, Delta. Get out of here. Warmack in the settlement. Keep your convoy away from it. Oh, Delta, I was going to do donuts around it. Be advised, Corporal. They're faster than they look. Delta out. <laughs> Evac convoy. Yeah. Lizzie's from the speed of it. The best driver we got. Everybody, stay back. They're coming in. Hey, stand down, Private. We're geared. Oh, shit, sorry, Lieutenant. No harm, no foul. What are you doing here? I uh, lost our DBs, and we got civilians holed up in here. Lizzie, Delta requesting civilian pickup. Sector 8, apartment complex. Copy that, Delta. I'll circle back. Thanks for that, Lieutenant. No problem, Private. Come on, Delta. You guys here to pick us up? 
we're not, but the convoy's on the way. Careful out there, sir. We'll go. Let's go, Delta. Holy shit. Is that Augustus Cole? Control! Need backup! A smash of things about this! Control. I took care of it. DBs, we gotta secure this street. Listen! Oh, please, sister! You're crazy! What can we do to help? Just clear this street, Delta. Otherwise, we're stuck here. All right, you heard her. Let's get to work. Baird, we're assisting a stalled convoy. We might need reinforcements here. Roger that, Delta. Diverting a condor your way now. Phoenix, for the last goddamn time, I'm the ranking officer, which means I call in the reinforcements. Yes, sir. I, I will fix it. civvies you found. Delta, Carmine's squad just got overrun. They're hunkered down with civilians inside the tower. They're not gonna last if you don't get there soon. They need you at the hub. Go! You can get there through the park. Gates by the steps. All right, you heard her. Let's move.
Oi, Del. You're gonna be okay. You know, you might not have a problem with shooting innocent people, but I do. Innocent, huh? Innocent. So people throwing firebombs are innocent. <laughs> Good to know. Both of you, knock it off. Wait, I heard about this. That was you three? Not three. One of us managed to keep his DBs under control. What the hell happened? We identified an insurgent element and eliminated it. No, you opened fire on a protest. Every herd needs a good culling. I know who I'll call from this herd. Look, what happened, happened. Right now, we focus on completing this evacuation. Goddamn right. There's the hub. Dead ahead. Shit, Carmine is definitely in trouble. Nah, uh, it's like we gotta cross it the other side. through here. Shit, snatch it. That thing makes its way to the hub. Carmine's problem is gonna get a lot worse. Clear. Thanks, Delta, but you got more damn bogeys incoming. 
Hey, our supply drop is still out there. So put Baird's new Lancers to good use. Welcome. You keep those civilians safe. We'll handle things out here. Uh oh, what do we got? Oh, Lancer grenade launchers. Where the hell does Baird find the time? Yeah, get them where they're hot. Make this work. Here they come! All right, Delta, let's light them up!
clear. Oi! Whatever happened to that snatcher we were following? Oh, you heard that? Stay back! Firing raid! That thing ain't swallowing me up! Oh, hell no! Plaza secure. Continue the evac. Copy that, Delta. We're coming out. All right, evacuees, listen up. Double time it to the Minotaurs. No personal items, no luggage. What you death? No personal items. Carmine. Man, you kept a lot of people alive today, Sarge. Ha <laughs> ha! The grub killer retires, baby! Grub killer, swarm killer, whatever. Yeah, rescued by my old trainees. Uncle Clay! Yeah, and now I gotta get up again. Was getting worried. You didn't report back. Radio died. And these guys pulled me out of a jam. Guess I owe you twice, Phoenix. Upgrade, Jack and Stimmer away through that fire. Okay, go, go. Oh, that's strong stuff. Got about that. Looks like it's stim time. Logging unknown enemy time. Damn it, in the first! Yo, over there! Snipers! Then let's clear them out!
we got them all. That block thing can shut down our box. There's no way we can hold this settlement. JD, go! Marcus and I have to bug out at the wall. Swarm is everywhere. We can't raise control. Ugh, something's messing with our comp. You read, Kate? We got separated from Cold Foss and Carmine. Then we gotta regroup. Meet us at the theater. Wilco, see you there. JD, come on, let's cut through the hotel. Come on, in here. Yo, Jack, give us some light. Oh, shit. We're losing a lot of gears. Phoenix, I made it back to my convoy. Gonna try to get these people out of here. Copy that, Lizzie. Good luck. Stand down. Set step down. Down, it turns them. What the hell, man? Oh, shit. We don't want to wake up. Let's get the rest of Going in there, Del. Get ready. Damn, I can't believe this turned to shit so fast. Hey, cold and fast, calm out. You said they're okay? I hope so. Let's get to Caden, Dad. Then we can worry about the others. Oh, shit. We're going that way.
miss this, JD. This way. Shit, shit, shit! It's the best! What the fuck is that? Who gives a shit? Just kill him! The leeches, man! Be dead. Loud and clear. Heads up. That flock thing's made up of leeches. Yeah, we know. They're messing with our comms somehow, but Baird's got a squad cleaning them off the radio towers. We're at the theater. Are you close? Down the street. We're on our way to you. Just regroup with Marcus and Kate.
About time you two showed up. Glad you're safe. Baird, we got him. Where do you need us? Well, at the theater, there was a group of evacuees there. Lost contact with them an hour ago. Okay, we'll round them up and get them to safety. And Baird, if anyone calls for reinforcements, don't do it. Roger that, but there's a lot already out there. Understood, Control. We'll keep an eye out. No one back here. Let's check the stage. Uh, uh. Hey, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Just a headache. Okay, let's go. Damn it. Nothing. People were here. Where'd they all go? Maybe they got out. Let's get that curtain open. Hey, Jack, pulse. Okay. Let's try this one. Uh, guys? You got a problem. Corrupted DR1? That can't be good. Look behind it. The evacuees. They're all dead. Let's just stay quiet and try to get out of here. Oh, God damn it! Kill that thing! Get out of here. Bonnie up. Hey, think we can exit stage right. Put this to good use. Foz, the Carmines? What's their status? Lizzie made it back to her convoy, but she keeps getting rerouted. Clay found a raven out, but I can't reach Cole or Foz. You heard from him? No, not yet. But we'll keep looking. Control, it's Delta. You're breaking up. We're at the theater. Say again? We gotta get out of there, kid. They're letting the settlement go. Wait, can't we use the Hammer of Dawn? Not when I can't talk at the damn thing. Just fall back to the main gate. Baird, we're stuck on the other side of town. Phoenix, Libby here. You're at the theater? Lizzie, thank God. Affirmative. I've been diverted like six times. I can pick you up. Coming your way now. We'll be here. Delta out. In here, come on. Whoa, 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 it's us! We, uh... 
brought company. So, Dell, see any friendly faces you recognize? Maybe that's the uh, peaceful protester who broke my nose. You deserve worse than a broken nose. Why don't you show me what I deserve? Stop! Yeah, enough of this shit! You're a goddamn coward! A coward? Wow. Well, have I got news from Mars? Don't. Guess who ordered the first shot, Dell? Directly into those peaceful protesters of yours. I mean, they were throwing incendiary... The whole thing was confusing, all right? I, I didn't mean to... Have it happen. Never mind. Gather's here! Look. We can discuss this later. Come on.
work. Uh, Baird! Baird! What's going on? I can't control the... Iris, shut it down! Shut it down! God damn it! Just run! How about you let him decide that? Hey, it's her. Your funeral. <laughs> Can't come here with colored weapons. Hand them over. You know who my father was, right? Who my mother was? And yet, you're the one in cog armor. Go figure. Man, we're not giving you shit. Just... Do what they say. Fine. You can pick these up on the way out. I'm through! He's out back by the steam farm. Try not to cause any trouble. That's up to him. You know, we've convinced a lot of outsiders to come over to the cock and fight, but I got a feeling this... 